Hi and welcome to this quick start guide to using automation for vMix. So when you first run the application, um, you will see a red box pop up that says click here for help. If we click on this, um, we can look over here at what appears. So you should end up on this web page and um, we can use this web page to pick up the template spreadsheets. So if we click on the blank schedule, by the way, you need to be logged into your Google account in order to be able to do these steps. If you haven't got a Google account, um, please sign up for one and then come back and, and watch this video again. Let's uh, look at the blank schedule. So if we click on that, um, it will open up a blank Google Sheet. Now we need to make a copy of this so that we can use it. So what we're going to do is go up to the file menu, if I look at the right screen, um, and in here you have an option to make a copy. So you click on that and then you can give the, the sheet a new name if you want to. Um, I'll just call this one Giles for the time being. Um, and then you can choose a folder to put it into if you wish to or just doesn't really matter where you put it and then you click OK. This will open a copy, a new copy of the sheet. You can see it's called Giles here. Um, the next thing that you need to do is to click up here on the green share button and click get shareable link. This will create a link to the spreadsheet which we can now copy. So it says the link has been copied to the clipboard, so we can just do done. What you need to do then is to go back to the automation app. I've already put my keys in here, but if you want, just paste the, the whole URL in there that has been copied onto your clipboard, and you will see in the log window it says reading scheduled data. You need to do the same for all three of these. Um, I won't show in the video, it's the same procedure, just close these out. So you click on blank titles and then when it's finished working, file, make a copy and then after you've made a copy remember to share it and paste the link into automation. Okay, so once you've done that you're ready to go, everything's installed and up and running. Um, all you need to do then is to choose uh, which part of Automation for Femix you're interested in using and have a look at the other videos in this catalogue. See you shortly.